Hi, Austin here from Laser and thank you for joining us. Today's instructional video is on the new GPS Sports Watch S20. This video is set up into three parts. Buttons and shortcuts, setting the time and time features, and main features. For now, let's look at setting the time and time features. Setting your time zone. Keep pressing the mode button from the main time screen until set appears. Then wait 3 seconds to enter this menu option. Use the start stop button to then move to the time screen in the sub menu screen. Enter this function by pressing view lap. T1 or time zone 1 will appear. The number 1 will begin flashing. Press the view lap button to enter the T1 settings option. Press the start stop button to toggle between manual or GPS time updating. Then press view lap to confirm your choice. For manual time settings, as we've selected, the next screen to appear will be the time screen with set T1 and the hour digits flashing. The word hour will also be displayed at the bottom of the screen. Use a combination of the start stop button to advance the digits or the light set button to reduce the digits. Then the view lap button to save the data and move to the next section. The subsequent sections are minute, second, year, month, day, select between 12 or 24 hour time, then the date format day then month or month and day. The next press of the view lap button will take you back to the main time setting sub menu. To set T2 or time zone 2 field, press the view lap button again to move back into the same time screen sub menu. T1 will appear again with the number 1 flashing. Press the start stop button to toggle to time zone 2 or T2. T2 will be displayed with the number 2 now flashing. Then follow the same steps as set out for T1. GPS time updating. If selected, the next screen to appear will be the city time zone screen. with three country code letters flashing. You have 36 city codes to choose from. Use the start stop button to scroll through the codes and use the view lap button to confirm your choice. A table containing the time zone numbers for Australia is supplied at the end of the product user manual. The time will be updated via GPS once the GPS function is turned on and is synced successfully. It does not update immediately after setting this option. Adjust any subsequent fields which are daylight savings time, twelve or twenty-four hour time, and lastly the date format day month or month and day. Press the view lap button again to return to the beginning time submenu screen. Well that concludes this section for setting the time and time features. We hope this video has been informative. The next section will be on main features. Thank you.